Morning. 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 So, as part of our sort of we series of videos to sort of ease your boredom during the lockdown, I thought I'd do a wee guitar lesson on Twist and Shout by the Beatles because it's really easy and the chords are a good sort of stepping stone into learning a lot of songs really. So if we start off as D, G, and A. So I think I'll go a bit closer so I can show you each chord. So D would be your index finger on the G string on the second fret with your ring finger going on the B string on the third fret and then your middle finger going on the high E string on the second fret and then that should sound like and then we move on to G which is middle finger on the low E string on the first fret with your index finger going on the second fret on the A string and then these two fingers just go on the bottom two strings on the third fret so that would sound like and then A is just three fingers in a row on the B, G and B so that should sound like and then it's just a case of practicing that switching between the three chords over and over and then in terms of strong patterns I'll move so you can see <laughs> so it would be D and A I'm trying to figure out in my head how that works so it would be like down, down up you can figure it out <laughs> 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 Go with the flu, nice. man. Go with the flu. <laughs> and then from there, there's loads of songs that use that sort of chord progression, and I just thought it would be an easy way of getting into it, really. So. Hopefully that helps. Good stuff. <laughs> Easy enough. <laughs> I like it. Good stuff. Beatles this time. <laughs> I'm going to take the digestive from the back of my phone now. So <laughs> <laughs> Is that you, Dan? <laughs> yeah, that was it. <laughs> All right. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Excellent.